Sam's kind of hitting the ball a little bit. Yeah, he's uh, locked in. I'll say that. Was that. I mean, that at bat was probably one of the best. Of, I just told him that. So that at bat was probably one of the best at bats I've seen in a long time. Because when you're fouling off pitches and fouling off and then hit a ball, the way he hit that ball, that was pretty impressive. Do you have any idea where that thing landed? Because I don't. Well, and, and again, it wasn't so. I mean, it was awesome. The, the, the distance that was a, a good one, but it's just so impressive that you just didn't foul off, foul off, foul off, stay on the baseball, and then put a swing like that on. It was that was big time. What's uh? I mean, I guess how how well has he been seeing it? I mean, obviously you see the numbers and everything. I think he's hitting 520 in his last nine games or something like that. What's he's just he, he's staying on the ball and staying through it. He took some um, his rounds at batting practice. I remember at Iowa and I watching him stand behind the cage and just how it was one of the most impressive displays of batting practice I've seen. And so I said, I go, this dude's locked in right now. And he's kind of carried that over. You, even in the beginning of the year, you were kind of saying that Sam might, you know, have a season sort of overtake Swerver on some level. You kind of knew he was going to be locked in, especially because he was healthy. I mean, has he pretty much been everything you kind of expected more so? Yeah, and he's, it, and it's it's finally clicking for him. And, um, but yeah, the power stuff, it was just a man. He kind of did the same thing last year. It took him a while to get on the board with that. And once he's, but when he's locked in, he's as good as there is in the country. Another game, another notch in the record books for Joey. All-time wins leader. Just, you know, your thoughts? Well, it's, it's a cool, you know, it's a, it's, a, it's a cool thing. It's a great thing. And I think he'll be the first to admit to, to get wins. That you you got to have some guys doing some stuff around you. But I still, you know, go back to the, the day of recruiting that guy and, and uh, to sit here now, four years later, almost four years later, and think that he sits atop the record books of uh, uh, at Indiana University is it's an awesome thing. I'm very proud of him. And, and um, you know, a lot of season left to go, so he's going to make it hard on somebody to get him, I can tell you that, in the future. You lose, what, three for three today, and uh, what does it do when you're, and now he's over 400, uh, what does it do when your five hole hitter is? Uh, in 400, how much of a boost is that for your lineup? Well, it's huge. It goes back to, you know, we've said all along that that's kind of what makes us a little bit different is you got to work all the way through. And, um, well, at least all the way through five or six, we're still working on there towards the end. But, yeah, to have him sitting back down, arguably one of the best hitters in the country, sitting in the in the middle to end of your order is, is, is a nice luxury for sure. I was just pulled Joey out of, uh, after five. You were up eight one at that point. I mean, we were just basically just trying to get other guys work and try to keep him, you know, as fresh as you can going yeah, forward. Yeah, I mean, we we I mean, we honestly we even kicked around the idea of not starting him this weekend to skip a start just to have him fresh for the Big Ten. But you know, he's he's feeling good. We were our plan going in was to hopefully get him five and then uh, get him out of the game. And you know, I would like to have seen the pitch count down a little bit more than that. But it was our plan to just go five with him today. Did you want to just get you know get the record out of the way too you know so you don't have to take it into a Big Ten series and things? Like uh, that he, he's going to be mad at me for this, but I honestly I didn't know, I really didn't. Uh, somebody said something after we took him out. He goes, "That's that's it." You know, I I didn't know. So no, to answer your question, the answer would be no, because I was ignorant of the fact. <laughs>